Today we're going to do part two of Trivia Mania! Woohoo! Yeah! So today we're going to do part two of the Trivia Mania. Cool. Hey, how are you feeling, Rex? Good. I'm feeling good. good. So, Darth, Darth Vader took my place last time. Yeah, he wasn't quite as good at the computer stuff as you are. I know. I think that's kind of funny, actually. Yeah. Yeah. I heard he has poor eyesight. He had poor eyesight. It's in the computer. Yeah. I hope maybe, he didn't... What? Maybe you should have glasses built into his mask. I know. <laughs> yes, I am itch. Yes, and you can see my t-shirt right here. You can always see that. Uh-huh. It's weird. <laughs> so... <clears throat> Do five more questions? Yeah. Cool. So, Darth Vader, I hope he didn't ruin my last podcast, did he? No, nah, he didn't ruin it. <clears throat> Just not quite as smooth as it was with you. I know. <laughs> All right. I think we're going to start. I, saw, I still have the websites. Uh huh. So that. All right. So, where we left off. Yeah, we'll start with that one. What we left off is what president was shot while walking the California governor, Jerry Brown, and office? And that would be, answer is, Gerald Ford. Yeah. Mm-hmm. A Gerald Ford, which is the son of Henry Ford, the one that invented the cars. Just kidding. Yeah, because his last name is Ford. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. So, what's our next question? Who earned inf infamy? <laughs> Who earned infamy for noting a billion dollars is not what, what it used to be? And the answer there is... Let the viewers think. J. Paul Getty. Yes. Don't say the answer before they're done thinking. I don't. I didn't think they're done thinking. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I forgot to. I lost count. Okay. One, two. Third question. What ethnic, what ethnic group was largely responsible for building most of the early railways in the U.S. West? And the answer... No. Now let the viewers think. Yep, I know. With their powerful minds. Going nice and slow. Close your eyes and <laughs> think. I will say the answer. Not you, but I will say the answer once you're done <laughs> thinking. Yeah, once I think you're done thinking. Are they done thinking? Um... Yeah, I think they're done now. Uh, the answer is the Chinese. Mm -hmm. Lots, lots of fun free trivia questions. So why don't I it's read? So why don't I read the next question, and then that way you can say the answer after the appropriate amount of time. Yes. All right. So this question is: What, what former, former speaker? speaker of, oh, you want to say it? <laughs> no, I want to make it a duo. Oh, okay. All right, so uh, what, what former, former speaker, speaker of, of the U.S. House, House has a chair, chair in Peace Studies, studies named for him at Indiana the University of Ulster? And let the viewers think. Dun, 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 Okay, I think they're done thinking. The answer to that is Thomas P. Tip O'Neill. Uh huh. Thomas P. All right. Okay. Now, last one. Are you sure it's the last one? Yep, because I was four. This is number five. Uh, oh my dear God, excuse <laughs> me. <laughs> 
Oh boy. <laughs> so this one is what was a gladiator armed with in addition to a dagger and spear? And let the viewers think with with the music again. Da 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 da. <laughs> Alec. Dun 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 so is that a lot? Is that, that was, the last one? That was our last one. Okay, everybody. Wait, I, I before we end, mm -hmm. I just want to tell everybody that I got married. <laughs> uh, yeah, it was an edible. This ring, this lollipop ring. Apparently, there's these things called that. It was called a ring pop. It's named. Apparently, it's named after. After that, um, that candy named Ring Pop. Not the candy, the lollipop. Candy <laughs> is thin. Uh, I think so. Yeah, I got a ring that looks horribly. It, they did a very horrible job. Horrific job. I tried to do a replica of the Ring Pop. <laughs> but I still like my ring. Shows a symbol of getting married. And I know well, I'm a little too, I look a little too young to marry, but, uh, yeah. That's funny. But still, I'm going to wear this ring in my podcast from now on. Like, every single podcast. So yeah. I need to keep this ring equal, even though. You can tell equal. you're done eating it, though. No, you can't eat, I don't want to eat my ring. You know, so it already looks eaten already. They did a horrible job at doing a replica. Uh, it's laughable. <laughs> sorry, sorry, um, Ring Factory. Okay, so we can end this. Bye bye.